Meanwhile, Iowa Attorney General Brenna Byrd's office says that 67% reimbursement claims for emergency contraceptions are currently on hold. According to the Iowa Public Radio, the pending claims would cost the state about $2,600. Now, there is one claim of an abortion for a sexual assault victim on hold, and that would cost the state $730. The state's attorney's office says Byrd is reviewing an audit of the state crime victim compensation program, which that is a part of. She's looking at whether funding emergency contraception and abortion for victims is an appropriate use of public funding. And Planned Parenthood North Central States released a statement about the number of payments on hold tonight, which said in part, quote, Attorney General Byrd and Republicans pushing these dangerous policies to take away Iowans' bodily autonomy are hurting the most vulnerable Iowans who are bravely coming forward to receive care after being violated in the worst possible ways. It's unjust and cruel. These survivors should find comfort in having compassionate, comprehensive care they need, end quote.